switch on the power. Machine initializing. Normally, our machine is delivered to overseas to not need the password. That this machine is only for uh, in China, so you don't need to consider about consider about the password. You see the the panel, the main screen, uh, the product the, the, the panel. Uh, see some buttons, and then uh, if you want to detect some uh, one, one kind of product, you can choose. The product number, we have more than 50, that you can choose one. So today we, we choose uh, number one, for example. Then choose the product. You have a turn on the top. You see, uh, for, uh, we see the menu here, the uh, function options. You can uh, renew the name of the product one, for example. So uh, I, I randomly uh, choose one name. For example, the name is AB. OK, you see on the panel. Name product uh, A B. So the first uh, step we want to do is to auto learning the product. If the product uh, uh, which need to be auto learning must uh, be normal with no uh, contaminants. You see the auto setting here. We put the products on the belt. When auto learning processes, any metal contaminants is not allowed to, to be close to, to the metal detector. The purpose of auto learning uh, process is to suppress the the metal signals interference from the product and to show the metal signals of the metal test pieces. The auto learning uh, Time limit, time range may be, may depends on the different attributes of the product. For this kind of product, uh, uh, if after uh, auto learning, the next time you don't need to auto learning again. Uh, for example, if you ne next time if you want to detect the product like this, you just uh, choose the product uh, uh, one and the name A B, and then you don't need to auto learn. Okay, it's finished. Now it's finished.
finished. So if we, if we, will, if we want the machine to alarm, so we must to go back to the main menu. Now we see the, the menu of the product. The product is that one which has been uh, altered, set it. And then we, we press the run button. So this product is the normal one with no contaminants. It's okay. And now I choose the test test pieces FE zero point seven and put in the product. Ah, shallow a little bit. No, not Alarms, which means that uh, the sensitivity, uh, the this size of the test uh, pieces or the uh, metal contaminants can be detected. And then I, I, I want to use another test pieces, the standard steel 1.2 millimeters. And also put in the product 